Some of the world's most iconic cities, desolate and a devastating global milestone, international cases surpassing 300,000. Now the Olympics, symbol of unity and human achievement, under threat, a decision to come within a month, but Canada and Australia already pulling out. Italy suffering its deadliest day, its death toll now 5,500. Italy's hospitals are battlefields. It's a, a very dangerous, is a, a disaster, is a, a, a tsunami. The worst crisis since World War II, says its Prime Minister. Italian nurses posting pictures of their exhausted faces, scarred by masks. In Spain, more than 2,000 have died. Its leader warning, the worst is yet to come. Germany's Chancellor Angela Merkel is in quarantine after her doctor tested positive. But this morning, hope from Britain's Oxford University telling NBC News they may have a vaccine within six months. The target is to be able to say that you've got a working vaccine as early as July. That's the, the ambition, absolutely. Not guaranteed, but I think we have a fair chance of doing that because we're using a vaccine type that has been in thousands of people before. Other vaccines are in development in the US, Germany and China. We are aiming to make not millions, probably not tens of millions, but ideally hundreds of millions of doses of this vaccine. Billions of people around the world now staying home. But in Australia, people are gathering. Lines at unemployment offices, a chilling echo of the Great Depression. The Pope praying above an empty St. Peter's Square. And by video, urging companies to resist layoffs. Saying every man for himself is not a solution. Many athletes, when it comes to the Olympics, are worrying that even if there weren't spectators, it would be hard to compete amidst this, amidst this uh, coronavirus outbreak. President Trump just uh, tweeting uh, Savannah, saying, we'll be guided by the wishes of Prime Minister Abe of Japan, a great friend of the United States and a man who's done a magnificent job on the Olympic venue as to attending the Olympic Games in Japan. He will make the proper decision. You know, Savannah, if it is delayed, if it's Tokyo, say, 2021, what a thing it would be to have the Olympic Games when we put this crisis behind us, Savannah. We all want to put this crisis behind us, Kira. Thank you.